firing squads are now a legal form of execution for death row inmates here in South Carolina after the governor signed a bill allowing it into law. And this comes after the State Department of Correction said they have not been able to buy that medicine required for lethal injections. In a tweet, the governor said in part the families and loved ones of victims are owed closure and justice by law. He says now the state can provide that. Kaylin Hagwood has a closer look at the law and how opponents are responding. There are 37 inmates on death row in South Carolina. Now those who have exhausted their appeals and are up for execution will have three options. The electric chair, firing squad, or lethal injection. The lethal injection choice is really a false choice because they uh, say they don't have the drugs to do it and they say they're not able to get them. So really you're looking at a situation where they're going to uh, electrocute them or shoot them. John Bloom is the director of the Cornell Death Penalty Project and has been counsel in capital cases argued before the U.S. and state Supreme Courts. Before the bill allowing firing squads was passed, he says the default choice of execution for inmates was lethal injection. Now the default will be electrocution. It's unclear exactly how the firing squads will work as the State Department of Corrections continues to develop protocols and procedures. A spokesperson for the department tells News 19 they're looking at other states for guidance and will inform the state Supreme Court that they can carry out executions, but the only method available at this time is the electric chair. I mean, it's pretty barbaric to think we're going to start taking people out and, and having citizens shoot citizens uh, of that, or that we're going to put them in the electric chair when the last state courts to consider it have all said it was unconstitutional because you're effectively are cooking people to death. According to the SCDOC, three inmates have exhausted their appeals and could be eligible for execution soon. Kaylin Hagwood, News 19, WLTX. Since the death penalty was reinstated in 1977, South Carolina has put 43 inmates to death. 36 with a lethal injection, the electric chair was used in just seven of those executions. Only eight other states have the electric chair as an option to execute inmates. All right, South Carolina is now of four states that use a firing squad and it can be used as a legal method of execution. Here's the other ones are Mississippi, Oklahoma, Utah, and now us. Lethal injection remains the primary method of execution in our state in other states. Firing squads have rarely been used, though. In fact, according to the nonprofit group Death Penalty Information Center, a firing squad has only been used three times since the death penalty came back in 1976. The United States is one of a shrinking number of countries that still retains capital punishment. According to Amnesty International, 108 countries have abolished the death penalty, including Mexico and Canada. In America, there is no consensus on the issue. 23 states don't have the death penalty. Just this year, Virginia abolished executions, commuting all death sentences to life without parole. The governors of three other states have issued moratoriums on executions.